Hello everyone. In this video, I'm going to show you how to add hardware to your virtual machine in VMware Workstation. I'm going to use a Windows 10 virtual machine in VMware Workstation environment. I'm going to add a couple of hard disks and a network adapter. And after I turn on this virtual machine, I should be able to see those hard disks and a second network adapter. Before I start, I make sure that the virtual machine is turned off. And then I go to edit virtual machine. I can select from here or I can go to VM and settings or I can right click on the VM itself and then select settings. It will bring you to this page. Next, I want to add hardware. So in the hardware tab, I click on the add button. And then uh, since I will add a hard disk, I will select hard disk and go next. And I want to add a SCSI hard disk, which is recommended and go next. I will create a new hard disk. So I select create new hard disk and go next. I will add a five gigabyte of hard drive and I prefer to keep the hard disk is a single file so i select the store virtual disk as a single file and go next i want to give a name to this virtual disk and i will to name it as disk one and then finish i want to add another virtual disk so i go to add and then it's hard disk next scuzzy next and then create a new virtual disk next as a five gigabyte and single file next and this is disk two and i will go to browse and make sure this is the virtual disk that i added before so this is gonna be the disk two so save and finish the second hard disk was added next i will add three more the fifth hard disk i'm gonna add as 20 gigabyte next 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 20 single file next disk 5 i'll show you where these files are saved so go to browse and this is the location where the virtual machine itself is located so these are the disks files that are created when i added four additional hard disks as disk one two three four this is gonna be the fifth one so finish now we'll add a new network adapter so select add and network adapter and then finish i can change the settings of this network adapter if i want um, breach mode and nat mode allows this virtual machine to connect to the outside network or internet and host only only let this network adapter to communicate with other VMs inside the same physical machine. So the hardware have been added. Now I click OK. If I turn on this machine and go to Windows, I should be able to see all the hard drives and the second network card in there. I should be able to see the second network card if I go to network setting. So I'll go to network setting from the network icon, right click open network and then ethernet 
and then change adapter option you can see that there are two networkers Ethernet 0 is the one that was there before and I configured this with a static IP before as you can see and an Ethernet 1 is the one that I just added and by default it's getting an IP address from a DHCP server if I do want to configure this network card I can do so uh, but I'm not gonna go to that direction right now also the hard drives that I added I want to show you if I go to the disk management create and format hard disk partition so you can click here that shows all the new virtual disks that I added okay and this these are not formatted no disk volumes were created and they have all unallocated space okay so i'm gonna cancel this for now if i do want to use any of these disk drives then i have to first initialize them they're saying as not initialized i can do so by right clicking and then initialize and also i can create volume and assign and drive letter currently if i open the file explorer i will see only one drive which is the c drive where the operating system has been installed okay i hope you found this video was helpful if you would like to receive notifications on future videos Please make sure you are subscribed to my channel and set up notification by tapping on the bell. Thank you for watching.